also for a record, I should express my profound disappointment in the inability of the chairperson of the Electoral Commission or any of her deputies or any other member or management of our electoral process from not participating in this exercise that were duly notified that she would be here and probably she must give reason to Mr. Speaker and Mr. Chairman why she should not be cited for contempt because we raised this at business committee a week earlier. Leader responded a week after and gave us indicative that she would be here. And there are primary issues. One, matters relating to final certified voter register. Two, status of verification devices and equipment procured and the quantities and challenges to her budget, which is in her own interest that she must avail herself uh, to respond to them. And in particular, the increasing of the polling stations is also provided for by CI. She cannot somoto and unilaterally just increase it, which is not consistent with the law. Thank all the presenters. And I believe that what they have done would aid um, transparency to ensure free, fair, credible, and peaceful elections. And that's the reason why we invited them here. The speaker, um, the EC could not be here, and I agree that they should have been at the center of this. Unfortunately, even though we had indicated that they were to be invited, the letter of invitation was not served on them on time. They, they indicated to us this morning that it got to them very late yesterday. I kept banging at their doors that they should at least put in appearance to address the nodal issues. And when uh, it became difficult, because the chairperson herself was not in town, um, I, I gave indication to the minority leader. That is where we are. And, um, so eventually, I think the, the letter that they sent to us indicated to us that they were prepared to meet us next week. Unknown to them, that parliament is adjourning on Saturday. And that's the reason why we kept banging on their doors that, no, they should be coming. But they wanted a very structured presentation, and they insisted that it was going to be difficult for them to do that. Because at 11, they had a meeting. The two of them who were even left here had a meeting with uh, foreign, foreign observers. So it's a reason why they couldn't be here. Um, the chairperson called to give indication that he'd be arriving in town uh, late this afternoon. I wanted to see if possibly he, she could come tomorrow. But tomorrow is Father's Day, and too many of us will be away from the chamber. So, yes, it's not a holiday. So we have, we have I gave indication to her that Saturday in the morning, because we are adjourning Sunday in the morning before we commence, she should be here together with her team that, to brief us. So that, I've not shared the information with the minority leader. It's the reason why I was not comfortable even disclosing it. But that's what I was just discussing with her, that certainly she has to be here.